sleep. Sleep is a very important thing for us humans to do, right? And sleep can be a very difficult thing to do comfortably and enjoyably for, you know, many different people for many different reasons, right? Including myself. I myself have been struggling to sleep for like the past like three, maybe four weeks or so. And that is what leads us into today's video and the product we're gonna be unboxing and reviewing. The purple pillow. So you guys have probably seen Instagram ads, TV ads, anything in any ad, anywhere you would see an ad, you've seen ads about the purple pillow and it's like critically acclaimed and whatever. It's supposed to be this revolutionary pillow. So I went and spent the money on it and bought myself a purple pillow. And we're gonna see if it'll fix my sleep because for the past three or four weeks, like I said, I've been struggling to uh, just wake up feeling rested, wake up without neck pain or back pain, or you know, just get what I think is a comfortable sleep. So we're gonna unbox it today, see what you get and everything, and then we're also, I'm gonna sleep with it for a couple of nights and let you guys know what I think of it after a few nights of sleep and that sort of deal. So without further ado, I suppose we should start unboxing it. Shout out to my multi-tool users. But uh, it's a pretty big box, as you can see. So I guess let's get into this. This should be the pillow. And I actually have a second box, which I can show right now. Oh, look at that. Look what they put on the box, guys. It says to subscribe and leave a like on the video. Wow, dude, that's crazy. I, I mean, I'd listen to the box, honestly. So what should be in this box, on a real note, is just a pillowcase for the said purple pillow, right? Uh, because I figured I might as well buy the correct pillowcase for such an uh, exquisite and unique pillow, right? So I should give it the full uh, benefit and try and really make it work out the best I can. God damn, this box is hard to open. All right, we're getting somewhere. So let's scoot back here, show you guys what we get right away on the inside. Holy shit. So that is crazy heavy. I mean crazy heavy. But that box, we're done with. Toss that to the side. Toss that to the side. Let's read whatever this is real quick. So we have this nice purple material, which is what the pillow is supposed to be made out of. If I had to take a guess. Uh, let's read it. It says, boost your sleep. Make your purple pillow perfect for you by mixing and matching the purple pillow boosters to achieve your preferred height. As you can read right there. And it says instructions. Unzip the purple pillow cover. Insert one or both boosters to match your desired comfort level. Zip the pillow closed and get to snoozing. Simple on off. So I'm assuming this feels very weird by the way. I don't know if it's like it's supposed to be a stress toy or what necessarily. Oh, it's like a little bed. Interesting. So this thing is heavy. It, it's chunky boy. But let's take it out of the bag here and see what we're working with. Toss that to the side. Oh my god. Okay. So there is your pillow. Uh, here's the back of it. You can see this is a zipper that goes all the way along it. So take out your boosters. So I will show that right now. Whatever cover is on it right now, by the way, feels incredible. Like it feels really soft. Um, so here's booster one. This is just like a foam booster. And then you have booster two. You have your purple pillow. 
just, that makes me lightheaded when I smell that for some reason. I don't know if that's a good thing or not. Maybe I just shouldn't be smelling it. But it doesn't smell terrible. It looks really weird. It's very, you know, squishy. It's got that. It's got this white powder in it too, which is uh, what they say is polyethylene, which is a pretty common thing, I guess. So I'm not worried about that. And it doesn't have a weird smell like a lot of people say theirs had when they got it. So I guess I got a good one that didn't have a weird smell, which I'm fucking incredibly thankful for. <laughs> so I was not trying to sleep with a pillow that smelled like shit. All right, so now we have the pillowcase box over here with our multi-tool again. Let's unbox this. And see what we get in here. So that box is empty. We have a soft stretch pillowcase with a two pack. Just in here on that. I got like a like the like the mist gray or some shit like that color. That's what I think it was called. So let's see it here. Feels awesome. Just you know. It's a fucking pillowcase, but you know, feels really great. I think that's gonna be perfect. So that's the unboxing process. There's all you get when you do buy a purple pillow. Now for details, I should say this is just the, their normal like signature purple pillow. You know, this is not the like special one or anything like that. This is just their original like base version. And uh, these were an, an add-on. You don't get these with the pillow. Um, I don't know if I said that or not, but I had to pay separately for the pillowcase. Yeah, so I'm gonna give it a few nights of sleep and whatever, and then I will come back. And uh, yeah, after a few nights of sleep, I'll let you guys know. I'll probably give you an update tomorrow, letting you know like how it was after the first night and then like you know, after a few days and that sort of thing. So we will uh, see that, but I'm looking forward to it. It feels very comfortable and whatever. And this material is just very different than any, you know, typical pillow you're ever gonna see. So I'm really looking forward to it. And uh, I think it's gonna be interesting. If you guys are also looking forward to it, then hitting that subscribe button or leaving a like on this video or even commenting would uh, mean a lot to me because we're gonna be doing much more content Smart Bar is back, baby. I'm so excited to share some of this content I got filmed for you guys and whatever. And this is just another one in the works. So, Purple Pillow review. Let's give it a shot. I'll come back in a few days. Welcome on the vlog camera. <laughs> uh, there's the Purple Pillow right there. I moved all my other pillows over to the other side as I sleep on this side of my bed. I put both boosters in it and I wanted to give you guys like a first impression when I put my head down. It's so weird. It's incredibly comfortable right off the bat. I cannot even tell you how comfortable that is. Just putting my head down like that. Now, I also wanted to mention that I am like a combination sleeper, mostly on my side, but sometimes I'll end up on my back or on my fucking face into the pillow so we're gonna see if it's good for like all kinds of sleepers or not since i kind of toss around and whatever all night on my side yeah it feels incredible so it's been about two weeks since i filmed the last part of this video on the purple pillow so what are my overall thoughts on the purple pillow is it worth it is it the pillow for you? So I've slept pretty much every night, except for like a couple I've been at a buddy's house or something like that. Um, on this pillow, I have not used any of my other pillows whatsoever. It's been solely this pillow since that last clip you've seen. And so what are my thoughts on it? So my overall thoughts on this pillow is, it is extremely comfortable. This pillow is the most comfortable pillow I've ever used 
and I can say that hands down, and I've used numerous amounts of pillows. You know, up until this point in my life, I've all just used like those like cheap, like $23 Walmart pillows, you know, even cheaper than that. You know, just never found something that was consistently giving me great sleep and stayed cool throughout the night and that sort of thing. However, with this pillow, I feel like it remains cool the entire time you sleep on it. And I think that's largely to do with like the air pockets in it. It looks like this. They sent me this like little, this just came in a box with it. But you know, it, this is exactly what the pillow looks like on the inside. Obviously I have my pillowcase on it and everything right now. But all those like air pockets and stuff, I think that uh, does a fantastic job of keeping the pillow cool all night. I know that's a big thing for a lot of people uh, sleeping. They don't like a hot pillow. I don't know if there's anyone that does, but I myself am one of those people that also hates having a warm pillow. So let's talk price. So the price for this pillow, it was not cheap. I paid $140 total. I paid 107 for the pillow itself. And then I paid an extra like 25 or whatever, you do the math on that for the pillowcase, right? So the pillowcase, I love the pillowcase. It's super soft, super, uh, just a really good pillowcase. So I wasn't mad about spending that money on pillowcase. However, that's not needed. Uh, so let's just focus on the pillow itself. The pillow itself, I got on sale for 107 bucks. It's normally 130. So do I think that's worth it for a pillow? At first glance, no, that's way too expensive for a pillow. It's way too expensive. Who would spend that money on a pillow? However, when you realize that sleep is so important in our lives on a you know nightly basis, um, it kind of makes you want to invest into a pillow that you think can genuinely change your sleep and change your you know your overall life just by having better sleep and better quality sleep um, and using a higher quality pillow. So. I think this investment for me is going to be worth it. Again, I don't know if I mentioned this or not in the previous clips. However, they do offer a hundred day like return, uh, like free return policy. So you get like a hundred nights of sleep on it. And then if you don't like it after 99 days, 10 days, 20 days, whatever it is, you don't like it. You don't think it's going to be for you. Just send that back. You get all your money back and that sort of deal. So that's really cool of them to do. Uh, let you actually test it out for 100 days. So that's like three months worth. You get to test out this pillow and see if it's going to be the one for you or not. I already, like I said, love this pillow. I think it's a great investment I made. And just overall, my sleep has changed. I haven't woke up with any neck pain ever since I've used this pillow. Um, I still get like some back pain or whatever, but I think that's largely due to the mattress I use. Um, and just, you know, working out and that sort of thing. My body's getting old, bro. I'm getting, getting fucking old already. However, all in all, I think this pillow is fantastic. I don't know if there's any better ones out on the market right now. Um, for the price point, maybe. I know this is like a really, really expensive pillow, like I've said. However, I love it enough to where I will continue using it until it shits out somehow. Um, I do sleep with both boosters in the pillow, so I'm a guy that likes the, t you know, this pillow on its higher setting, I guess, or higher size. And I also don't sleep with the pillow flat like this. I kind of sleep sleep with it like at an angle, like like that, rather than this. Um, so I kind of lean it up against like my headboard and that short, sort of shit. Um, and that just all obviously comes down to a preference of how you prefer to sleep. Do you like your pillow like flat or like at an angle, or whatever. Um, I also am a huge person. I wanted to mention this. I'm a big person at having my arm under a pillow, like sticking my arm underneath um, my pillows. I don't know why I've just always done that. I like having my arm underneath my pillows. And sometimes I'll even like put both arms underneath my pillows, whatever. Um, and I think this pillow is great for that. So, you know, I can have my arm underneath my pillow and sleep like that and it works just fine. Uh, obviously I'm not over here flipping and turning this pillow every night to get to like the cool side because like I said, this pillow stays cool and remains cool throughout the entire time you're sleeping. Um, I sleep for on average six to seven hours a night and the entire time I wake up and the pillow is still cool. 
I also have woken up uh, where I've slept on my, my back of my head before. Works great. Both sides, left, right side of your head, works fantastic. It's not super breathable when you're like, you know, fucking suffocating yourself. So if you sleep like that somehow, you're a maniac. But sometimes I, I you know, that's the most comfortable spot sometimes. So even I'll do that. But um, it's not the greatest for that. Um, just breathing into it, I guess. <laughs> um, but all in all, I think this pillow is definitely worth it if you have the money to invest into it. And I don't see myself ever going back to um, a pillow of a lesser quality than this. I'm not saying I'm gonna stick with purple my entire life, but as of today, I am going to continue using purple for the rest of my life, and, or at least a pillow of high quality. But yeah, I think that's all I had to mention. I think that's all I wanted to really talk about in this, this clip of the pillow. We already did the unboxing and everything else. So these are just my overall final generalized thoughts on the pillow itself. Um, obviously, take a booster out, put a booster in it, depending on how you like your pillow. Um, I do recommend buying a pillowcase as well with it if, if you just want a high quality pillowcase. It's not a must at all, um, but I, I don't see the weight of the problem being, or the weight of the pillow being any sort of problem at all. Uh, I actually like having a heavy pillow now after these two weeks of use, and again, it truly has just changed my sleep and changed my my overall quality of, of sleep and whatever. And I wake up feeling way more refreshed in the mornings. So with that all being said, I think that's going to do it for me. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. I know it's a little bit different than some of the other content I film. However, if you did enjoy this video or you just want to support me, leaving a like and subscribing would really mean a lot to me. Also comment down below something about how your day is going or just general, any questions, whatever. Let me know in the comments below. Let me know how I did on this video, anything you think I should change. And if you have any future video ideas, I'd also love to hear that. I'm, I will be responding to comments. So anything you guys want to say at all down there, feel free. With that being all said though, I hope you guys are all doing well. Just make sure you're smiling and laughing every single day. It's really just that simple. Just, you know, go say hi to someone new, impact someone else's lives just by even saying hello. And yeah, stay safe out there, and I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you so much for watching.